What's up guys, welcome back to Mr. Tech Boss and in this video I'm going to be showing you guys or giving you guys the first look of MIUI 12 running on my Redmi K20 Pro. Right here I'm installing it right now and I hope this is the first time you're seeing a K20 Pro running uh, MIUI 12 at least on YouTube. So without any further ado, let's jump right in. Okay, so guys, this is it. This is the Xiaomi uh, Redmi K20 Pro running uh, MIUI 12, the latest version of Android or MIUI from Xiaomi. And uh, yeah, I'll set it right up and I'll try to show you guys the setup. I'm just, this is not my proper setup. That's why I'm a bit, uh, it's like a bit wonky. That's why I'll just uh, set both my sims as this one and my Wi-Fi call is calling is already working and this is it you can install Google Play services and you can run it or you can wait for two days for Xiaomi EU to release I'll set it right up and I'll get back to you in a moment here are the two themes that it gives you the option to choose from I'm gonna go with this new one because I want to see the new gesture animations and obviously it's gonna use the new gesture animation okay there we go and we are done we're in MIUI 12 and this is just amazing guys okay so guys this is it this is uh, Xiaomi Redmi K20 Pro running the latest version of Android from uh, from uh, Xiaomi and this is the MIUI 12 I know you guys want to see a lot of things in here let me just zoom out a little and just a sec there we go I hope that's the correct focus yeah there we go and firstly i want to show you guys that it is indeed the latest version of xiaomi uh of uh, redmi k of what is this called of miui 12 running on my redmi k20 pro and as you can see from here this looks amazing it looks really really good and this is the new notification panel but sadly the new recent panel isn't out yet but i have to say these gestures are so smooth like they actually feel 60 fps and xiaomi is done a really really good job with this version of MIUI and I I don't know I'm just really fast uh, really quickly going to show you guys some of these settings and so we can go into here and no it does not have the option to change the recent menu and I don't know what this is let's see what this is actually so as you can see right now I'm running this uh, latest version of uh, MIUI 12 as I've said a million times already but as you can see it is like uh, the gestures I mean I've made previous gestures on MIUI 11 these gestures but they weren't this smooth they weren't even close like this feels actually 60 fps I mean uh, in that video it, it was just uh, feel it just felt smooth because of the video I was recording at 60 fps but this is actually really really smooth I'm not running any OC mod obviously and uh, let me know if you guys have any questions I'll uh, leave them down in the description I'll make another follow-up video um, yeah uh, that's basically okay let's just see what this what the first is all about in this thing you can wow there are online items obviously this is the Chinese stuff and this was all okay so there's a whole new tab for all the new settings let me zoom in a little yeah so um, yeah so uh, let's see what else is there. Is there anything new? Doesn't look like it, but well, I want to see the dark mode toggle. There's a yeah, there we go. The dark mode is already here. I'll just put it at the top. Now let's see how it toggles through. Wow, that was I don't know what's wrong. Wait, now it's dark mode. And wow, this is the animation I was looking for. Like it smoothly transitions between the dark mode and the night mode or the the light mode this is exactly what I wanted yeah there may be some bugs but I don't see any it's just so good I mean I was an AOSP before this like the Scandin OS this is way better so you might have seen this in uh, online on some videos but this looks really really good look at this wow this is so smooth I mean this is amazing I'm having to like trouble it's a bit of trouble using my phone right now but wow man this looks so good Look at the animations they paid details to. Wow. This is just amazing. And if you're in an app and then you open it up, then once you exit it, it's gonna wait. It didn't happen this time. 
Wait, let's try again. Let's open some app, close it, unlock, and then yeah, again. So if once you exit, it does that wallpaper thing if you were already in an app when you close the lock screen. And let's see if there are any new settings in the uh, this thing. Yeah, let's see. Uh, so obviously you can put 5 by 6 that was before as well and uh, this should be uh, this thing as well so this is really this is really important and you can also do this it's obviously you used to be able to do this before as well but if you do it on the left hand side it opens the notification thingy and on the right hand side it opens the control center just like iOS like you do on the right hand and it's different on the left hand exactly like iOS guys it looks so good Let's make it a little uh, smaller. Whoa, it's a bit too bright. Okay, so what I want to do is basically go to display and uh, dark mode. If we toggle this, look at the smooth transition. This is exactly what I wanted. And I don't think, let's see if the wallpaper changes. It just becomes darker the whole screen, but the wallpaper is still the same. Anyway, uh, I want to change this. No, not this. Um, system this. I want to make it a bit smaller and definitely a lot thicker because it looks a lot better. And wow, this looks so good. I'm going to be using MIUI for quite some time now, finding out all the little details and just, uh, stuff that they've added. Also, this is a bit different. The battery and performance, it just, they're paying attention to like the rounded UI. It just looks so, oops, okay, there's some lag there. But yeah, I mean, it's amazing. I really recommend you guys to install this if you can live without the OK Google command because you can easily install Google Play Store uh, just by going to the Get Apps thing and it's easy. I don't want to waste time with that. And this is, oh wow, this, they've changed this one as well. So this looks different too. And I hope you guys can see it. I mean, let me enable dark mode. Let's see if that helps. And let's increase the brightness a little. There we go, I think it helped, but yeah, wow, this is so good. Uh, let's, oh wow, okay, yeah, this was also a MIUI 11 feature, but they've now integrated it well. And uh, yeah, let's see if there are any new sounds. Uh, that looks good, that is basically what it used to be like, but there's nothing need, they need to change here. I just wish they should have changed this one, maybe they'll do it in a future update, but uh, the first build, this is just as it was just the animation is a bit different and let's see if we uh, disable this and once we go back to the app it should smoothly transition yeah this is exactly what i wanted them to do and they did it and you can obviously add floating windows too so let's add this thing on top and then you can use it this is really good guys uh, you can also change the size i don't know how exactly to use it um, i might make a video if you guys really want it if you guys really want it but this was the first impressions if you have any uh, any questions uh, don't forget to leave them down and you can hide this indicator if you were wondering and also if you were wondering oops I don't want to do this if you hide it one thing one sec yeah if you hide it you have to move it a little up to switch the apps you can't just push the pill and then expect it to switch the app and even with the pill on let's just disable that and yeah you can do it pretty fast now because on android i mean uh, on miui 11 when these gestures were added you couldn't do it this fast but now they've made it fast and this is exactly what i wanted please leave your questions down in the description below and uh, uh yeah i almost forgot to show you guys this uh the new uh camera app let's see well for your 60 obviously it's there, it was there before. The switching is still a bit slow, but uh, let's see how this looks. Wow, this looks so sick. If you, got, if you guys have any questions, leave them down in the description below. And I'll, 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 wow. Okay, so they've done this. Yeah, this is just amazing. And uh, yeah, that's basically it. You can, there are more toggles. It's just me learning new stuff because I don't know a lot. But anyway, the front camera works perfectly and this is a makeshift setup but uh, yeah also guys uh, as you might have heard that there are a lot of uh, new things to rotation as well let's see if it is yeah this is totally it's really cool let me just uh, disable dark mode so it's easier to see oh, wow this is so cool and then in landscape mode when you normally let me just again enable this 
let's see your dark mode and wow okay so normally when you were in this page when you exit it was there was a lot of delay but now it's a lot better I'll try to install some games and see is it, if it's the same wow what just happened wow oh okay so the lot wallpaper does actually change uh, if you turn on dark mode and light mode I'll, 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 I'll try to make a new video soon because this was just a really qu quick overview but uh, yeah okay so guys that's for this video please don't forget to like share and subscribe and uh, if you have any questions again as I said leave them down in the description below I'm gonna uh, explore MIUI 12 on this device and maybe make a video maybe in one or two days uh, I'm gonna try to edit this as soon as fast as fast as possible but uh, make sure to subscribe and um, yeah, turn on bell notifications if you can. But yeah, this was Alhamid from the Tech Boss signing off.